That was very sad. All right, chat. Wind streak incoming. Hey, everyone. Uh, I tried out Quest Priest yesterday, and I can say Quest Priest is playable. Playable, uh, not necessarily good, but playable. It does some uh, cool things. Uh, I think one of the sort of the it controls the board well. Um, and uh, I think what you actually, I think people think uh, Quest Priest is a good deck uh, against control decks, but it, what it really is, is a um, good deck uh, against aggro. Um, it's got lots and lots of defense. What's hard about control matchups is we only run two five drops, which we really, really need to get the card draw. So sometimes we don't hit those. Uh, sometimes we get a mutinous, uh, a key piece. Uh, there are a lot of things that can kind of go wrong. Um, but the bottom line is uh, the deck felt all right, but also it's a very chill deck. So you don't do many things. You have to be very, very patient. Uh, I'm used to it drilled into my head of like, go for the win, uh, spend your mana, go for this. And I had... I think at least two games where I threw because I was too impatient where I could have won. Um, I thought my opponent had used both Nogglings, but they had one left in a game. And uh, they went Altar of Fire from their Noggling after I went uh, put my shard in my deck uh, with, for Zarella, and they were able to win. Where if I had uh, held on to it, uh, we probably would have won. So stuff like that. Uh, there's just a lot of paying attention to. But if you want to chill, just not do a very intense deck. You don't have to, you know, get ahead on board. You don't have to put pressure. Uh, it's all about just chilling, removing, playing a minion here, playing a minion there. Uh, I think this deck could be really fun. Um, and I know multiple Priest players. Theo, this is Theo's list. Uh, I know D-Money likes it. A lot of players have said they've done well with it. Um, that being said, I think the global win rate of a lot of these, these Quest Priest decks is around 48%. So... Definitely not top tier, uh, but I think it's a thing if you like the style um, and you're you know want to chill out and you can you know pay attention. That's really big. So if you're paying attention and watching, okay, how am I going to win this game? What's my win condition? Uh, how do I beat my opponent? What do I need to play around? Uh, I think you can do well with it. The hard thing is, is it's very punishing if you make one of those mistakes. So like I said, I I threw a game because I played into Altar of Fire randomly generated. Um, but yeah. Uh, bottom line, so what are we keeping in this deck? Um, uh, we're keeping Deep Run Engineer. We're keeping Thrive to get a two drop. We're keeping our three drops. Uh, and against Aggro, uh, we keep Zarella and also Light Maul. Uh, I'm not sure if I would keep it in general, uh, these cards without a two or three drop. Um, maybe on coin, I think it'd be more reasonable. But yeah, generally you want your two, three, fours to throw five six i've actually kept spirit guide a few times uh on coin i don't think i would keep it going first but because it's your only five drop i think it's a reason we'll keep on five um uh so the, the one of the biggest weaknesses of this deck is it's expensive i had to craft uh 200 400 stuff worth of dust that i'll never get back um but yeah it's uh so but yeah bottom line is this deck is fun it's chill uh but it's not top tier uh the, the reality is if you want to play a control deck control warrior is just better control warrior wins the mirror uh control warrior can win the mirror by either going nelly or just racing you on the kazakhstan um unfortunately but uh it usually they often can eat one of your pieces with munis uh and they can get a brand or a faster munis but yeah but uh yeah so you're keeping your two drops you're spending your stuff you get your shard in your deck uh, like I said, you can also use things like Spirit Guide and uh, Zarella to draw out your shards. So if you've used all your holy spells, um, that that will draw it. One thing to note, uh, be less ambitious. So when you go Thrive, pull and call the grave. Often I'm finding I'm running out of holy uh, shadow spells to draw. So uh, be, But yeah, I think one of the big things is to be worried about your hand size and think, okay, what am I going for? How soon do I want to pop off? Do I need to get rid of cards out of my hand? To make hand space stuff like that um but yeah uh it's a fun archetype uh and it's playable like i said it's not going to be top tier so if you really want a strong control deck go play control warrior but uh it's a very viable option uh if you're not if you don't need uh the perfect win rate so anyways got some games for you guys enjoy
Yeah, it's a, you get a two drop and then you can get a three drop. Seems reasonable. Hala. Classic turn one chat. I just was trying to emulate. All right, so. How does this work? So it costs one less, so. I guess I take a Magadon there. So would this would this count as a three cost card because of the discount? Does anyone know? If I play this and so it won't count as three, so I can't uh, picking picking this is kind of pointless, right? Okay, so I'll take a maga done. All right, good to know, chat. Good to know. Oh, should I regret? Wait, I did keep. Con wait, I gotta condemn, so we're fine. This one goes there. The pack will feast on your bones. Okay. Hmm, this is an interesting situation. I think we just hear a power pass. Um, I go this next turn, but no other play really. I mean, you could tap the amalgam here. Doesn't seem good. Oh, well, that's not. A, that's kind of annoying. I think. Light cannot exist without the, the, the dark. Wait, what? Chat, this is still a card? I forgot that this was even a card. Oh, God. Not the taint, chat. Not the taint. Chat, am I effed here? I might just be effed. Ugh, how do I beat this? You know, I'm gonna tempo this because uh, we need to do some damage on this guy. All right. <laughs> Here's the real beast turn. All right, let's see. Oh, okay, okay, chat. They, we baited them to take damage here. Ugh. The ultimate bait, chat. Or... Oh, this actually works out really well. Chat, look at that. Look at that. Uh, we were able to get the quest proc. Discover a card from your deck. Nice. Nice, dude. Easy. All right, what do I want here? Chat, that actually worked out so well. Ooh, I think I'm going to take the, the behemoth here, chat. I could take the mutinous, to be honest, but this seems fine. Do I have any five mana? Sp oh, wait, chat. I, I used up both my spirit guides. <laughs> You're right. I don't, we could just get one from uh, Call of the Grave. We're fine. We're fine, chat. We're fine. All right, here we go. That works. Hmm. 
I can hit um side effects. No. Light cannot I guess I might as well take this. Chat, my order may have been questionable. <laughs> my order was questionable there. Alright, chat out. My order was questionable. Chat, I'm, I'm channeling. Chat, I, I, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm channeling my inner poem, alright? Chat, I, I, I wanted to get the heal quest. Right, something like that. Um, what do I do here? Uh, where are my light shower elementals? Hmm. Locked up with somewhere to go. This might. Where are my light shower elementals at? Her reign ends here. Okay, um. I still haven't managed to draw my, uh... There we go. Locked up with somewhere to go! The path is clear for the world. Wait, Chad, if I play... <laughs> this is kind of a weird one. Wait, am I about... do I ever get scammed from this dude? <laughs> Wait! <laughs> this is actually so much damage, chat. That's actually just so much damage. Well, we got the behemoth, so we should be fine. This might sting. I'm picking. I cannot believe what I'm seeing. Ha <laughs> ha! Give me that health. All right, that was pretty fun, chat. That was pretty fun. Buff mana wasted. Each scar, a foe vanquished. Right now. Do 
Do I play the Zarella here so I can get my quest done? Zarella would make me... Alright, let's, let's get the quest. Kind of fun. No cards to overdraw. Yeah, I thought it would draw me six cards, and then I realized it's only the shadow spell, so. And then it's like pretty easy to. So. Alright. I think we're in a pretty good position. Order. Oh, this guy's actually a card, dude? I forgot about this guy existing, chat. Okay. Um, all right, I want to get my uh, Zarella down. Let's. Hmm. By the light of the Naru. All right. I mean, we have one and four to win next turn, but I mean, they're probably just going to concede here, to be honest, but this is nonstop. I feel like that should be a, a reasonable archetype. Uh, I feel like fell DH is, but the multi-strike nerf might have been too much. All right, let me get my purifier. Let me play the purifier, dude. Let me play it. Let me play it. Don't concede. <laughs> Don't concede. Oh, why did I play the view to this? I should have just played nothing here. Oh, wait, I had to play this. Wait, wait, am I going to die here? No, no, I'm fine. Okay. All right. Don't concede. Don't concede. Let me play the purifier shard, please. No need to concede here, dude. Nothing to concede. They're realizing they're dead on board no matter what they do. But come on, don't concede. Don't concede, dude. Don't concede. Wow, they're roping this. Just just pass. Just go face. Let me play the shard. Your opponent left. I got I gotta play it before they can leave. They get the opponent left. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Don't concede, dude. Dude, conceding. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, wait. How did they? Okay. Die! There we go. Chat, that was pretty sick. Should have used the shard instead of trading. Um, I've got news for you. We still would have been dead there. <laughs> so, uh, well, good hand chat. The light dims, but we That's a lot of mechs. So that's kind of rough. Let's 
Holy Nova is very good, but like Shadow Ruin actually feels more useful. To... Oh god, their hand's so buffed up. I already have a shadow on a spell, so I don't really need it, but... They're gonna have a buff ass hand here. But we got lots of plays here, so we should be fine. Honestly, Light Maw is really good there. Uh, I could take that, but I wanted to have my five drop here. I have, I have, I have, I have multiple plays. I could do a uh, shard, point spirit guide here. Oh, top deck to that. I'm lucky. I really want to steal them, but they're likely to play the seven drop here. Initializing descent. Mm. What could have 
have sworn it went back together. No more. All right, this is pretty fun. Initializing the set. Holy crap, is it going to be a big, uh, can I go face with, uh, my Sneed? Doesn't look like it. I could hit, um, I hit uh the the three mana guy we win right. What does Sunken Sentinel do? I can't remember. Does anyone know? Ooh, Divine Shield, Taunt, Life Steal. That seems kind of good. I'm just going to put him down to one life. This seems like a winning play. Hmm. They have to trade, dude. But looks pretty good, chat. So no hands. What's your final verdict on curse lock? Um, it's a. Uh, I don't have a final verdict, right? I have an intermediate verdict where, um, I'm not like. It feels like a deck that I need to know the meta, to to make the right list. Um, it's not a like. It's it's a. It's a that's kind of what I feel with that. So it's like it's awkward because um. We've only played one spirit guide this game, right? Those we love are never truly lost. 
But can't I just ping their face next turn and win? Let's see if I top deck purifier shard. Ah, I didn't get it, chat. Um, well, I think I just silence here, and then we, we ping their face next turn for lethal. Seems good. <laughs> Got him. All right, chat. Quest Priest OP. Okay. All right. That play was always incorrect. Very top deck. Sex goal meeting again. Today's Saturday, right? No, you're supposed to take Shadowward Ruin and just play it next turn, honestly. Bodalish is like this is a prime gaming. Get on that such anything so much Bodalish is. Hmm, these suck. Yeah, it might have been just right to play the Shadow Ruin on four there. You can't play it? Oh, can you not have a Shadow Ruin? Yeah, I should have just wasted it on. Locked up with somewhere to go. All right, chat, redemption. If you, dude, dude, I'm losing because I'm throwing because I'm being too, like, not patient enough, Theo. Like, I'm just like, no, I'll be like, oh, I could do this. And so, I mean, we're 40%, but like, I, 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 uh, once I, I learn patience, but it's like every cave is like a half an hour. So it's like, you just want to get, you want to like go for the win and you really can't. You got to chill. You got to take it slow. Uh, well, that that's not the way we've been losing to warrior we lost the warrior because like they go freaking nelly you know
Crap, I overdraw here. My hand is too full. Honestly, I have everything I need to win. It actually might be a good thing to overdraw. I don't know. Do I have any more shadow spells left in my deck? Oh, I have that one, yeah. Alright, we're out of shadow spells, which is, uh... But we can, uh, we can go Zarella and always draw this. Chat, we could honestly just win with, uh... A big amulet of the undying play, but I mean the the weapon version. Oh, they're not even yeah, they're not even cause for the chat. So I guess I want Munis here. Hmm. This keeps drawing cards. I mean, do they ever play minions? Like. Yeah. Mm. If I can hit shard. Oh, no smite, easy win. Ah, uh, wrong minion, dude. Yeah, no smite, but they could have smite in their own hand, right? So... Nudis incoming. I don't even know if their deck runs Muninus. Phew. 
<laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Draws me two cards. Uh... Light cannot exist. And three Zarellas in hand, dude. That's true. All right, I think we got them, chat. I think we got them pretty easily here. I think they did. I haven't seen your why quest priest. What does it counter, dude? Dude, here's here's if you, dude, if you have to. Uh, if you want a this is why we play quest priest this early basically the reason is cards got buffed and we're seeing how good it is you know oh no wait 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 do i win here probably win here all right do i get this 50 percent chance to draw a shard here ah you jerk chat we didn't draw a shard what the hell Seems good. Rogue Shard, I know, right? Chat, like we have multiple copies of everything. All right, we never get scammed here, right? <laughs> I know, right? I was very all right chat wind streak incoming it's gonna be a all right whatever I mean our opponent just has to have a uh, one mana spell and it's We're playing a really bad matchup here. So if they assume I have the shard, how does that change their play? Think about this. They assume I have the shard. They still... Chad, do I ever just not do anything for eight turns and then go coin Whirlpool? Like, I'm never going to beat them on the quest, right? Like, like force them to clear this minion themselves, you know? <laughs> I think that is the line. Oh, Najah could win. I see what you're saying. I guess I should be trading these. Yeah, it's hard for them to kill Najak effectively. Yeah, I mean.
All right, I could discover Zizhak from this. And they always concede. Okay. So, um, if you concede in that spot, you're an idiot. Uh, so it's a thing of uh, you want to if you want to assume my opponent is an idiot. Okay, we can do that play. But I, I'd like to have a shard of respect for my opponent. But maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. Oh uh, god, I I should have to overdraw here. Like I can't play any of these things. I can't play the condemn. Coin Warple is too slow, maybe. I agree. Uh the matchup is unwinnable otherwise though. So what we do is we force them to use a pyro or a one mana spell. Um I mean, we're getting there next turn, to be honest, so. Well, Coin Whirlpool, uh, it destroys their other boar. So if they don't, if it's in their deck, they just lose. Um. That's a wind chat. <laughs> oh god. Right. Rules over rules chat. I will let I will let the, the good people of my channel decide. Alright. Uh, ban. I will let the chat, good people of chat, decide. All right. So they said GG. You're not supposed to say GG until the game is over. We we won from a disconnect out. Very unlikely. Very unlikely, chat. It's it's a little. It's kind of sucky. But maybe a win's a win. I don't know. You you the good people of chat need to decide. Uh, chat, it's like I mean, they were they were gonna win. We were, we were they were probably gonna win, but that's the whole point of the rule. So, you know, I I've seen chat been defend people. I've seen chat say, I've seen chat be like, no, this is unfair, and vote against the ban. So, chat, if you don't think this was a good enough reason to ban, vote no. But if you're like, you've got your pitchfork sharpened. Uh, and you will throw someone in prison for life on a technicality, uh, vote yes. <laughs> you decide, chat. But I, I'm going full... Uh, what's his name? What's the guy from the Bible? Um, Pontius Pilate. Uh, I, I I wipe my hands clean. I'm letting what chat decide. All right. Wow. Yes, a win is a win. All right. Um. All 
All right, chat. I gotta find this person though. Wait, fate bonded. Oh, dude, fate bonded's gotta go. Wait. Wait, were there multiple people who said GG? <laughs> this is why democracy doesn't work. At least it doesn't work for some things. Chat, you know what? I'm going to show mercy. All right? I'm going to say we didn't have enough. I'm going to show mercy this time. All right? So... Oh, said it after the game. Oh, somebody else did it. I, I can't find the person's name, to be honest. Because you guys keep chatting. Um, oh, wait, I lost it, actually. There's too much chatting. I actually don't know who said it. So, Gotham did I don't know how... Chat, you got to give me their name. All right, what do I do here? Oh, I think I'm just going to freaking keep the... the path is clear. <laughs> oh, my... <laughs> <laughs> Time out compromise? Wait, wait, chat. Oh yeah, you, you did fate bonded. You're good. I just can't I can't I don't know chat, I'm really bad at this stuff, so it's like So this is where they log on to the stream and they decide should they play around Zarella here? Okay, chat, this is the most like I looked at the stream and I decided to play around Zarella I've ever seen. Like, look at this nonsense. Wait, Chad, how do I have two Najox here? That's pretty sick. Uh... What's my last chat? I've already thrown all my spells. I've got plenty of mojo to go around. Bruh. Ah, dude, the Leviathan. I wanted it, chat. I wanted it. Ooh, I'll take this, though.
Pepper Pandarian? Oh, that's, yeah. Robbed, Shab. You have to run deep, run engineer. Thanks, John Bray. You jerk. Yeah, we're, we're actually about we're, we're about to go into a positive win rate. I'm actually getting the hang of this deck. Mainly, I'm not throwing as much. Did I throw this one though? Who's the back deck now? I know, right? Hey everyone, if you made it all the way to the end, chances are you really like this content, so thank you. I'm glad you enjoy it. If you want to show your support of the live content, feel free to like and subscribe. But liking and subscribing always helps the algorithm of the show that you like it, so the, the thing is more likely to give it to other people. In addition to that, uh, if you are always wanting a No Hands Gamer video, but some days I don't put one out because I, you know, I don't know what to do, uh, we all we have another channel which is the No Hands Gamer VODs, which is the raw, unedited content from my Twitch, uh, where you get to see everything on the YouTube format. I highly recommend you go check that out, uh, so you can get your No Hands Gamer fix every day, even when I don't put out a normal YouTube video. Hope to get to see you guys in the next video.